Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully resolve if you're coming across the issue with Microsoft Visual C++ uh, 2015 redistributable. This says setup failed. One or more issues caused the setup to fail. Please fix the issues and then retry setup. And you're coming across this error code 0x8007066. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward tutorial here. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So we're going to go ahead and start by opening up the start menu. Just off on the start button one time. Type in run, so just R-U-N. This match should come back or run right above desktop app. You want to go ahead and left click on that one time. And now in the open field, you want to type in app, so appwiz.cpl. So again, appwiz.cpl. And then we'll left click on OK. And once you're done with that, you can close out of here. Open up a web browser. And you want to navigate over to Google. Into Google, you want to go type in Microsoft Visual C++ 2015. Anyone hit enter? Postman should be from a Microsoft domain here. This is down Microsoft Visual C++. I'm going to go ahead and open that up. Scroll down. You want to select the correct language and then select the download button. Select your 32-bit, which is the 86 download, or the 64-bit, depending on what version of Windows you're running. So if you're running a 64-bit version of Windows, you want to select the first one. If you're running a 32-bit, you want to select the times 86 version. And then you want to left go on next. And once it's done downloading, you just want to go open it up. So run it by just opening up the file. If you receive a file notice, you want to left click on run. You want to agree to the license terms and then left click on install. If you receive a user account control prompt, left click on yes. So hopefully at this point setup should be successful. Close out of here, restart your computer, and hopefully that should be about it. So as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.